the Youth Exploring Science, or YES program. It's a multi-year program where we work with teens starting at the age of 14 throughout their entire high school career. We expose teens to different STEM-related fields, STEM industries, but we don't just talk about it. We actually put these teens in those actual, actual real-world environments. The YES program is really one of our crown jewels. It's a program that we've developed many, many years ago, actually almost two decades ago now, that uh, is really focused on basically the educational path of the high school student, uh, and particularly those in the underserved uh, parts of our community. And it gives them an opportunity to, to have exposure to STEM careers and, and uh, that they may or may not have otherwise. It's really important that these kids see themselves as the next generation of STEM leaders because that's what they are. I'm Michael Brown. I'm uh, Frank Lita's oldest grandchild and I am the Chief Financial Officer of the Frank Lita Automotive Family of Dealerships. He's not a native of St. Louis. He's actually from Northwestern Pennsylvania. Came to St. Louis uh, through the military. He served in the Air Force during Korea and ended up being discharged at Scott Air Force Base. In 1971, he started with the Honda automobile, the car, and um, really haven't looked back. Our Charitable Foundation's mission is to provide safe and reliable transportation to those in need. Uh, that's important to us because as an automotive dealer, transportation is kind of uh, our, our core business. And rather than just uh, trying to give money to different causes, it's more fulfilling for us to to see it in action and that if we can help restore a vehicle, repair it, or help somebody acquire a new vehicle, because transportation is just, it's so important to everybody's day-to-day -day lives. It's, it's how we get to work, it's how we get to school, it's how we get to our doctor's visits. So it's very vital. And um, you know sometimes you can take it for granted and that's just something that we don't wanna do. We wanna make sure that everybody has access to safe and reliable transportation. The importance of the partnership with the Frank Lita Automotive family and the Science Center, it, it is really impactful to the organization as a whole. Um, with their long-standing support of the Science Center over the years for vehicles that we have used as staff at the Science Center and then even now expanding onto the YES program and bring, being able to bring education out into the community that might not be able to make it to the Science Center. Um, so over the past 17 years of the partnership, it has grown and evolved to where we are today. One of the things that the YES program shows is that once you go through the program, you want to give back. It just makes you want to give back. And we would not be able to do that if we did not have transportation to get to those areas. I believe that YES is very important because uh, education has a very soft spot in my heart. Uh, education, I think, is the one thing that nobody can ever really take away from you. So we just view that the Science Center is one of those institutions that just it's, plays a critical role in the St. Louis community with the outreach that they do and every all the good things that they do uh, to promote science, technology, engineering. Nobody does a better job of it in the St. Louis community than the Science Center does. You know, when they see those vans pull up, they literally scream like, oh, the Science Center's here. Having the access, you know, of these vans, getting us to those places. What a great opportunity these vans have provided.